We're at our red panda habitat, where today our team are going to give Tilly's cub its first health check. The team consists of senior keepers Amy and Kim, and also our vet Steve. And what Steve's going to be doing, first of all, is giving the cub a general health assessment, potentially trying to sex it, and also give it its microchip as well. The team are just around the corner, so let's go and see what they're up to. So today was a really big day for our red panda cub as our vet was here and we were able to give our cub the first health check. Unfortunately, we weren't able to sex the cub today. Uh, as you can see, our vet Steve was having a really good look, but it's still a little bit too young, and with all that fluff, it was really hard to get a good idea of whether it is a male or a female. So while all of this is happening, section leader Kim is feeding Tilly some of her favourite fruit in order to keep her occupied. So we're holding the cub by the scruff of its neck and this is exactly the way that Tilly would carry the cub, but she would carry the cub using um, her mouth to hold on to its scruff. So the cub is used to this as a sort of feeling, um, but it's very wiggly and it's even very wiggly when Tilly's trying to carry it around now. Uh, but as you can see, uh, they actually do have very sharp claws even at this young age and they are very strong. So it might look incredibly fluffy and incredibly cute, but it is still strong and we do have to be careful. Uh, we were able to give the cub its microchip today. Uh, so this is done in exactly the same way as you would to a cat or a dog. Uh, our vet uh, used a needle to insert the chip just under the skin on the back of its neck. And this chip will stay with the cub forever. Uh, this is especially important because the cub is a part of the European breeding programme for it because it is an endangered species. So if it moves to a different zoo in the future, we will always be able to identify it. So overall we are really happy with how the cub's first health check has gone and it looks like the cub is developing really, really well. Uh, it didn't take long and the cub was back in the nest box with Tilly after just a few minutes and then Tilly spent a lot of time grooming it and making sure it was all okay. And hopefully it won't be long now till the cub starts exploring outside of its nest box. <laughs> <laughs>